Hey guys, welcome to your love reading for Scorpio. This is going to be for your December 2024. You can apply this to your sun, moon, rising, Venus signs. So we are going to take a look at the person that you're dealing with, thinking of, separated from. We're going to see what this person's true feelings and intentions are towards you, okay? Apply this to your own unique situations. You can apply this to new love, current love, or an ex. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. I want to go live. Also, if you guys are interested in uh, following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that is dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Also, if you guys are interested in wanting to book a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. So um, let's get started here, Scorpio. Let's take a look at the overall energies between you and your person, the dominating energy between you and your person and your connection here first. And then we'll get into the tarot here. Okay, so we have Dark Knight of the Soul, Enhanced Awareness of Identity, an extremely difficult and painful period, personal and deep development of oneself here. So this could be you that's going through this. As you go through this Dark Knight of the Soul, some of you guys could be glowing up here, overcoming illness and negativity, feeling confident and being on the right path in life, connecting with others, positive vibe, and new phase in your life here. We have family ties, take each other for granted, stop learning from one another stuck spiritually helps each other grow not only as individuals but as a spirit as a spiritual being here interesting as you personally glow up here there could be some sort of reconciliation here there could be there could be some sort of reunion here okay so you know whoever is going through the dark night of the soul either you or your person or both you guys here some of you guys could be coming back together here better than ever before Okay, what else do we have for, for Scorpio? What else does Scorpio need to know? Tell me about the person that Scorpio is dealing with here. What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Scorpio? What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Scorpio here for uh, December 2024? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Scorpio. So we have the High Priestess here and also the Emperor card here. Aries energy, Cancer, Pisces. So there is someone here that you're dealing with here could they could be leveling up here or some some here or is someone here is sort of like getting themselves together here or that someone here is stepping up to the plate. Okay. Whoever this is, I feel like this person's like trusting their higher self, trusting their inner self here, trusting their inner truth. All right. Whoever this is, I do feel like this person is ready to come back around to build a life here with you. Okay, so with the ace of swords here and also the empress. Libra Taurus energy. This is a divine counterpart here, Scorpio. So whoever this is, yeah, some here is coming back around to work on things here with you. But here's the thing. I feel like with the Ace of Swords here and the Empress here, I feel like you made it clear that you are walking away from this person for good here, okay? Whoever this is, I do feel like there is someone here that's watching you, someone here is spying on you here, and someone here is definitely trying to manifest this relationship back. Like, I feel like this person is putting it out there on the universe and hoping that this will return back to them or hoping that you will return back to them here, Scorpio. Okay? Some of the high priestess here. Why is the high priestess here? The high priestess and also the ace of wands. Some of the emperor here. Why is the emperor here? And also we have the knight of swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. So we have the ace of wands, the knight of swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini here. Okay? Yeah, we do have some here that's definitely looking for a passion in the beginning here. After the dark night of the soul, yeah, some here is returning back to you. Ace of Swords. Ace of Swords here. And also the Queen of Wands here. Interesting. If there was another party that was involved here, like I feel like this party is no more. Yeah, uh, this third party is no more here. With the Queen of Wands, Aries little Sagittarius energy. I feel like, you know, um, if this person went towards a third party, I feel like maybe this led this person down to the Dark Knight of Soul here because I feel like the third, third party couldn't even handle your person here. Okay, so we have the Devil card here and the Empress. The Devil Capricorn energy. We have the Magician here and also the two of swords and the page of swords here and we have the seven of wands okay yeah i do feel like if this person is coming back around here i do feel like you're trying to block this person out so you know some of you guys are not really even giving this person another chance here like i feel like you guys are fully really truly done with this here what else do we have for for scorpio 
talking about Scorpio here. What does a Scorpio need to know? Look out for work on outcome and advice here for Scorpio. So we have the Judgment card, Seven of Cups, the King of Pentacles, the Three of Wands, and the Ace of Cups here, the Justice card. Okay, so we have the Judgment card, Sagittarius Energy. We also have the Seven of Cups here. We also have the King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. We also have the Three of Wands here and the Ace of Cups and the Justice card. And the Ace of Cups and also the Justice card, Libra Energy. Yeah, you know, I do believe that this person is in love with you. I do feel like this person has learned from their mistakes here. Uh, you know, this person could have taken their time to clear out their karma here. Any sort of confusion that you were dealing with this individual here, you know, I do feel like this person is definitely becoming more and more and more clear. So why is the Judgment card here? Why is the Judgment card here? The Judgment card here and the King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. The King of Cups here. Oh, I'm so sorry. The Seven of Cups here. The Seven of Cups. And also we have the Death card, Scorpio Energy. We have some here that's definitely coming back changed. Yeah, like I said, I feel like someone here has gone through the Dark Knight of Soul and this person is returning back to you. We have the King of Pentacles here. And also we have the Three of Pentacles. You know, this person's intentions is to work things out here with you. This person wants to be on the same team as you here, uh, Scorpio. We have the Three of Wands here. Why is the Three of Wands here? Three of Wands. And also we have the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, this person cannot see a future here without you. This person wants to build a future with you. Okay, this person wants to make you a strong offer here. Yeah, whoever this is, Scorpio, like I said, I feel like this person's coming back changed. This person's coming back different here. Some of you guys might not even recognize this person. Some of you guys are kind of like, who are you? You know? So what? Uh, the Page of Pentacles here, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, and the uh, 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 and the Justice card, and also the Queen of Pentacles. We have the King to Queen of Pentacles. We have the Empress of the Empress here. This is a true pair. This is a soulmate connection here. Seems like there's going to be some sort of reunion here. And like I said, if there's any parties that were involved, if this person went towards another party here, that party is no longer in the picture here. Here's the thing. I feel like, you know, after they left you, you left an impression in this person's life here. And I feel like when this person stepped into a third party situation here, I feel like this third party could not even handle your person here. And I feel like that's when this person made these changes here. This person went into the dark night of the soul here and did what they could to come back around. Okay. Now, if you have a family with this individual here, there's a possibility that you and your family can come back together here if you choose to take this on here because i do feel like this is looking really good here i do feel like with the knight of cups here cancer scorpio pisces here i do feel like this person is genuinely sincerely um very sincere about this oh look at this we have the king to queen of cups here too true pairs so there will be a there will be there will be uh, there will be a heart to heart here there will be communication here uh there will be a reconciliation they will be a getting back together here. That's if you guys choose that, Scorpio, because at the end of the day, even though the energies are coming up this way, you still had your direct experience with this person here. And I feel like you have, uh, you know, you still have free will to choose whether this is right for you or not. Okay, so <clears throat> Scorpio, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell and I will speak to you guys in the next one. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for tuning in and I will speak to you guys in another reading. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.